Hey guys, it's Heidi from Scandinavian today. So I was just in Drauer. Drauer is an old fishing port that was established in the 12th century. It has a lot of historic charm to it with old cobblestone streets and yellow Danish painted homes. And it's just an absolute wonderful day trip to go to if you are in the Copenhagen area. Now Drauer is just outside of Copenhagen and it's an easy quick drive to get to. Now my family has been going to Drauer for many, many years and I've seen some fabulous photos. So it's definitely one of those areas that you can just take photos, 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 photos and just get some beautiful photos from your day trip. Now we went there and I was with my uncle, my aunt, my cousin and a family friend. So when we first arrived, we needed to kind of get our bearings. So we kind of, you know, poked around the harbor area. And then once we started walking, we passed an old smoker. And the smoker actually is meant for smoking fish. And then next door to it, we went to a restaurant called Cafe Esperson. So let's take a look at that clip. right there, the top of the roof, the little space is meant for the wife to look for the fishermen coming home. So this is the smoker. So I am going to have smoked eel. So here we're going to have smoked eel with egg and tomatoes and chopped chives. And then we have it with a stick of bulgur. So I was so excited to have my smoked eel. I hadn't had smoked eel in ever, so I was really, really excited to have it. It tastes so delicious as well. And as what well, you could see that there was also it's called tregang sil, and that is three different types of herring. And my uncle he had that, and I was able to sample a little bit of that as well. And that was so delicious too. So. You know, both the Tregan Tzu and the um, smoked eel, those were about $15 and you definitely walked away feeling like you ate a nice lunch. So it was definitely worth the money and the service was great. So I definitely suggest if you guys are in the area, make sure you check out that restaurant and thumbs up for sure. You know what, the other thing I also loved about it is that you, um, you were right by the water so you could actually sit outside if you wanted to and it, or you could have like a window view of the water as well so it was either way it was really really good we sat inside that afternoon now 
once we were finished with our lunch, we went outside and we decided to go across the street and, you know, walk through the cobblestone streets. And as we were doing it, I noticed that there was the museum, and it's the Dwayne it's Museum, right on the left hand side. And then on the right hand side, I think that is where Sean Kikagor used to hang out at at a hotel. So I believe that is the hotel that I saw on the very right hand side. So it was pretty cool to see too. So next time I come to Drauru, I definitely want to be checking out the museum and the hotel for sure. So let's take a, a look at where, where were you walking and let's look at the next clip. Now we're going into the town of Drauru. It's so charming. Ready to leave Drau. So I had a lot of fun going through the cobblestone streets. I definitely took a lot of photos for sure. Now, if you're able to get out to Drau, I definitely recommend it. You know, do it. it's a wonderful day trip. Now in the month, they're gonna be celebrating National Herring Day. So I would be definitely checking out the smoker over there and Kathy Esperson. I'm sure they're gonna have some delicious herring for sure. So I hope you guys enjoyed our video today and please make sure you subscribe and click like. I'll be putting the links down below of all the places that I did see. And as well, I'll be posting some more videos of my trip to Denmark and Iceland. Have a great week guys, bye.